Hey, welcome to Wednesday Wisdom for this week. Way back in ancient times when I was in high school, I had this really good friend. Um, he was, you know, the all-American boy. His name was Bob, and he was really, really smart. He was a great athlete. He was a good-looking guy. You know, one of the guys that you'd say would be most likely to succeed. And he went off to some college, I forget which, and, uh, didn't turn out that way. Um, he started smoking pot and then went on to other drugs and dropped out of college, never finished. Kind of had really messed himself up and, and his life really took a bad turn. And he never really made much of himself, could never hold a job. He wound up dying many years ago. Um, it was really a sad, sad story, a life with a lot of potential. I was reminded of this because I was up in Massachusetts and I was driving down and every town there now has multiple cannabis dispensaries. It's all the rage. Um, there are more of them than convenience stores in most of these towns. And this year it's coming to New York as well. We're in a mad rush to legalize marijuana and cannabis products. And I really wonder how much good it does for our society and our culture. Obviously, not everybody who smokes weed winds up like my friend Bob. But a fair percentage of people do. And it really makes me wonder why we're in such a rush to do this. Um, especially when we have such, such a hard time trying to teach values to our kids and keep them motivated and have some purpose and meaning in their life. There's a lot of things that are legal, but they're not good for us, right? And I think we as Christians, we gotta be very discerning about all of that. What's gonna lead us to a better, happier, healthier life? What's gonna lead us to God? And what's gonna get in the way?